patching is widely regarded as one of the most important cybersecurity measures that any organization, regardless of industry, should enforce. Every day, new software vulnerabilities are discovered and fixes are released in response. As you might know from our previous video, security patches stop malicious actors from taking advantage of vulnerabilities that could disrupt business operations. According to cybersecurity researchers, 60% of cyber attacks are caused by out-of-date systems and applications. Unfortunately, despite the criticality of patch management, many organizations still have trouble successfully patching applications. Hello again, it's Antonia from Heimdall and today I'm going to talk about some common challenges companies face when it comes to patch management. Reports show that many IT and security professionals find patching to be complex and time-consuming. This is due to the fact that organizations must constantly identify and assess vulnerabilities as well as monitor and test patches before deploying them to their systems. The job is not over, even after you've patched the most recent critical vulnerability. Once the patch is deployed, new vulnerabilities will likely appear and you'll have to patch them again and again and again. You can think of patching as a never-ending game of catching up. Also, there are a variety of systems and applications. Every company now uses a combination of operating systems and third-party applications. This likely includes macOS, Windows, Linux, and other operating systems, as well as applications from countless different vendors. Managers are concerned that applying security patches immediately after release might break stuff. Indeed, there is a chance that some things will go wrong when updating software. This can sometimes happen even though the vendor thoroughly tested a patch before releasing it to the public. A patch failure can occur when you install the patch but you lose sight of the fact that you need to reboot the system. In order to address the issue, you should first test the updates in a test environment before deploying them. Lack of IT inventory management. This problem has become harder to deal with as organizations have shifted to remote work. Implementing asset control and maintaining an accurate inventory should be a priority for all companies. A detailed asset list can provide a complete picture of your company's IT infrastructure, including which endpoints and applications are vulnerable. This facilitates the prioritization of um, applications and assets for faster patch deployment. One of the challenges that may arise during the implementation of an inventory management solution is that only the most critical vulnerabilities will be patched. This does not completely solve the problem. Your company's endpoints are still exposed and there is no assurance that you will not get hacked. Hybrid or remote employees with systems that are connected to a domain only from time to time. Maintaining control over the devices you manage directly is challenging enough but it is more complicated and perhaps even more important to make sure that bring your own device or contractor devices are patched before they can access your company's resources. Shortages of security and IT staff. One common problem for any security or IT company of any size is a lack of resources for day-to-day -day operations, let alone the fire drills that each critical vulnerability triggers. Nevertheless, patching must be a top priority for your company. The risks of not patching your software outweigh the challenges you'll experience when doing so. Some of these risks are your business is more exposed to cyber attacks because hackers can exploit any found vulnerability. The financial impact of a successful cyber attack can be devastating. Potential loss in productivity. You'll be left behind with an outdated system and struggling to solve issues caused by not patching in due time. You can be fined because of a lack of compliance. Thanks for watching. Make sure you show us your support by liking this video, sharing it, and subscribing to Heimdall's channel. Stay close as in my upcoming videos, I will talk about patch management, best practices, and benefits. Have a fantastic day.